This morning, power is slowly being restored across Texas, but millions are still in the dark. So why is the power still out for so many of you? And why does it seem like no one, including Centerpoint and other power providers, can do anything about it? Let's break it down. So the state grid is made up of four parts, electricity generators like power plants, transmission lines, distribution networks, and finally, you, the customer. ERCOT, the Electric Reliability Council of Texas, manages the flow of electricity. Think of it like air traffic controllers. They make sure planes fly and land safely, but they don't actually own the planes. ERCOT dispatches power on the grid, connecting more than 46,000 miles of transmission lines and hundreds of plants but it doesn't actually own those plants or make the electricity. So when the snow and ice started piling up, demand for power surged, the grid couldn't handle it. And that sent some power plants offline. And when there's not enough power to send out, Centerpoint and your local electric providers like Entergy and others can't do anything about it either. And while they'd hoped to do rolling outages and spread the pain around, instead, they were stuck with a state power grid stretched to the limit and providers were stuck with bigger outages, leaving customers still without power. And speaking of feeling the pain, our